Hello again, in last session we have seen how to load the external javascript inside the html page by specifying the script tag and the source of the javascript file inside the head section and before the closing of the body section. So we know that whenever we mention the script tag which is responsible for downloading the javascript, as soon as the parser will find the, you know, the script tag then it download the javascript and then it is executed and then it will pass the html body so that is very time consuming because the body section has to wait until the java, external javascript is loaded and executed and even if you have some code that access the html elements then it will throw the error that we have seen in the last session to overcome that issue we mentioned the script tag before the closing of the body tag so that the entire html will be passed and uh, you know rendered then the script will be downloaded so in this session let us see how differ and async works so if we see here i mentioned before the closing of the body tag i just cut it and instead of that what i do i will mention the script here and this is like loading the javascript file inside the head section so along with that i just mentioned the keyword called defer so this defer is like a boolean attribute so whenever we mention defer like is defer true if you follow my last session there we were just accessing this paragraph inside the app.js then we are assigning some text to it so whenever we load it in the head tag it was throwing error because it couldn't find the paragraph element but using differ how it will behave let us see so what i do i just remove this and maybe with differ let's save it and let's go to html and run it we know right click open with the live server and let us see how it will behave whether it will throw error or it will show the result there you go so unlike loading the script inside the head tag without defer with defer you can see that you can see the result so though we mentioned this inside the head tag but we used defer here so what defer will do so whenever we mention the defer what it will do it will wait until the entire html is passed so once this html is passed and ready so then only the fetching of the javascript and execution of javascript will take place so that's why differ is more useful so whenever you want to load the scripts once the html is passed now let us see how async works so like differ instead of differ i just mention async so how this async works so instead of differ maybe i will mention async save it and let's go see you can see that now even with async so whenever you mention the async, the fetching of the javascript will take place asynchronously. So once the javascript is ready, then html parsing will be passed and javascript will be executed. Then again html parsing will continue. So this is how async will work. So now let us discuss the worst scenarios. So with the head, the javascript will be loaded first, then it is executed. Then only the parsing of the HTML will take place. So whenever we mention this script tag to download the external JavaScript before closing up the body tag, the parsing of the HTML will take place first, then the downloading of the uh, JavaScript and execution of it will take later. Differ is also almost same as mentioning the script before closing of the body tag, like it will wait for the HTML's parsing then only it will download and execute the javascript and whereas asynchronous it will fetch the javascript asynchronously while it is fetching async javascript asynchronously the html parsing also will take place and once the fetching of the javascript is completed then it will pass the parsing of the html then it will execute the javascript and then only it will resume the parsing of the html so these are the four scenarios you must know and these are most important interview questions too. The difference between async and differ is async blocks the parsing of the page while differ doesn't block. If you are more concerned about the speed then use the script tag inside the head section with the differ. So what will happen if you specify the both async and differ in the script? So when you specify both 
Async will take precedence on the modern browsers while old browsers will support the defer but not async. So this is all about loading external JavaScript in HTML page. Please subscribe to my channel and press the bell icon for more updates.